Okay. You have a good night. Constable Dale Hutler is one of Alberta's most prolific RCMP check stop officers. Often averages eight convictions per month. Every vehicle we pull over, we do an impairment and a document check. And uh, mechanical fitness of the vehicle, such as burnout headlights, stuff like that. We, we're always looking for that stuff. But during December, he and his check stop colleagues, including city police and provincial sheriffs, are very much focusing on impaired drivers. You, you wonder what's going on, but then you see all the vehicles, you know right away. It's a, it's a check stop. It's through the process of speaking with that person, getting the smell of the liquor coming from their breath and, and you know, their, their physical indicia, their eyes, their, their speech. You have to formulate your reasonable suspicion or grounds, whatever the case may be. Sergeant Howard Eaton also specializes. Nationally, uh, one third of all fatalities in Canada are caused by impaired drivers, 33%. And uh, last year we had 70 incidents in which impaired drivers killed somebody. Uh, and uh, so we're really trying to drive those numbers down and we need the help of everybody, the public. Everybody can play a part in, in, in reducing impaired drivers. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, would you mind? We get them to pull in between the cars. An officer will speak with them, make a, a quick judgment call. Do I smell liquor? Do I see any indicia? If not, send them on their way. Ask for driver's license registration if they choose to do so. Check those out, send them on their way, and try to keep the traffic flowing as quickly as we can and as safely as we can. I have no problem with stopping at a check stop. I think it's excellent because I think it gets impaired drivers off the road. Impaired driving is the focus for the month of December. You know, the, through the rest of the year, we focus on speeding and distracted driving and, and uh, pedestrians, but uh, the month of December is de uh, designated for impaired drivers, so you will see lots of check stops. We're always out showing the, uh, waving the flag and being out there doing our yeah. check stop. Making a difference? Oh, trying to, for sure. 0 0.08 is the Canadian legal limit for a criminal conviction. 0 0.05 is the Alberta sanctions uh, out of Bill 26 that will uh, see you uh, removed from your vehicle and have your vehicle impounded. I've caught as many as eight in a month. Um, typically for me, anywhere between two to five in a month. Uh, I think most guys are running pretty close to that. There's no peak time. I got one here just the other day, you know, 7.30 in the morning on a Wednesday, and th there's no rhyme or reason to it. Consider 33% of traffic-related deaths involved impaired driving. Drivers between 16 and 24 are most often involved. We're looking for both alcohol and drug impaired drivers. We have people that are trained and highly trained in both aspects. It's the time here we're coming to it, you yeah. betcha. For Go Edmonton, I'm Tim Dancy.